Trevor Noah, Donald Trump anti-Semitic dog whistle tweet heard by everyone. Trevor Noah joined the pylon of TV on-air talent going after racist Clementine Donald Trump s tweet featuring Hillary Clinton against a pile of money background to the words most corrupt candidate ever floating inside a star of David. The Daily Show host speculated Trump s camp had advised their candidate he could no longer go after Clinton with misogyny, to which Trump had responded, fine, I'll call her a Jew. Trump s campaign has insisted it was a sheriff s star but, even so, replaced it with a circle. His campaign as digital chief said he created the image, using a star from Microsoft Shapes. Noah insisted the shape is not anti-Semitic, until you put it on a pile of money with the word corrupt. In much the same way, a cross is not a racist shape, but if you set it on fire on a black person as long, then it has pretty pound sign dollar asterisk. Racist, Noah said. And, you know what else makes the star racist? The fact you got it from a neo-Nazi white supremacist website. He added, Trump's campaign is a total mess, which you would not know if you were getting your news from CNN, which yesterday brought out its newest hire to discuss the controversy, Trump's former campaign manager Kari Lewandowski, now a CNN commentator, and a man who literally signed away his right to say anything bad about Donald Trump, Noah noted. Lewandowski blamed political correctness on the part of mainstream media for whom he is now working. Lewandowski, while working for Trump signed that non-disclosure agreement that prohibits nearly everyone in his campaign to release any confidential or disparaging information about Trump, his family or his companies, according to AP which broke that story. He is a political commentator who is now getting to do Trump's bidding from inside. Why not just tire Malfoy to give his honest opinion on Voldemort? Noah pondered. I don't think Trump hates Jewish people, but I know some of his people do, in addition to black people, Mexicans. Muslims you know, most people, Noah said. Donald and his campaign don't do a very good job of disavowing those people, Noah observed, recounting previous Trump retweets, including one showing a swastika connects to Jeb Bush's family, and another from someone who claimed to live in Jamaica. Look, Trump, retweet something racist once you can say it mix up. Retweet twice, you can say you rebatted Twitter. But at some point, it is just racist.